Strange, there's nobody here. Let's look around. I'm not sure that's a good idea. Ah, uh, Luigi, come on. I just want to find Adriano. Ticket to Palmer. Uh, uh, what are you doing in my house? Why are you searching through my things? Regina! What is going on, Luigi? Wait, Regina, calm down. We were just looking for Adriano. Hey, ragazzo, get the ticket to me. It is mine. Oh, I'm really sorry. Here it is. I didn't give it back to me. Regina, I'm sorry for. It's Signora Valenti to you. Signora Valenti, I'm sorry for the misunderstanding. We were looking for Adriano. We thought he might be at home. I found this ticket while looking for clues on Adriano's whereabouts. Are you finished? Well... Get out, then! Regina, do you know where Adriano might be? He's probably drunk in his sheepfold. A sheepfold? But we don't have any sheepfolds in Porto Cesso. Oh, really? You have no sense of humor, Luigi. Try looking for him in the church. Now get out! Luigi, who was that? Adriana's wife? No, they just live together. How modern. Yes, and the townsfolk don't like them for that, as you can imagine. They seem like a strange couple. Yes, they are both quite the characters. Anyway, there is no sign of Adriano here. We'll have to deliver the trout by ourselves. Will you help me? Of course. Great, let's pick up the fish boxes at the harbor and bring them to the town square. So many boxes. How are we going to transport them? Look, there is a cart. We can load the boxes onto it using the crane. Damn, the handle is missing. It must be around here somewhere. This must be it. All right, let's load the boxes. Great, let's deliver the fish to Herman. Miss Myers, Luigi, thank you. You have literally saved me and the whole festival. Signore, signore, the fish has arrived. So, should we try to find Adriano? That drunkard, well... Regina mentioned the church. Let's go and check it. I haven't seen the church in Porto Cesso. Where is it? It is near the cliffs. I will show you. Let's go 
This way, Anna. So, this is our church. It's beautiful. It is, but it has been abandoned for quite some time. There was a landslide, and the church foundations Ooh. became destabilized. Oh, that's terrible. Yes, indeed. Well, let's get closer and look for Adriano. Adriano! Adriano! It's very dark. Can you see anything? No. I'm here! Help me! Oh my goodness! Are you okay? Yes. She's getting me out of here. There should be a rope up there. Okay. I'll look around. Great. I found a rope. Let's get him out of there. We've got the rope, Adri- <laughs> Oh, oh, look. My blonde guardian angel is here. You're welcome. Adriano, how did you end up down there? I was looking for some quiet, cool place. But why? To hide from the heat. It is August. Well, what can I say, eh? Mio Dio, Adriano. What happened then? I went down to the crypt, and then suddenly somebody dragged up the rope. I told them to stop choking around and drop the rope back down. But the good-for-nothing scum ran away! Do you know who they were? No. And they should pray that I don't want to find out. Adriano, what I can't understand is why you came here in the first place. Herman was counting on your help. You were supposed to bring the fish to the festival, but you went looking for some quiet, cool place. No, I told you, I couldn't stand the damn heat. Adriano, I don't want to hear it. Just go and help Herman. All right, all right. This is just unbelievable. Let's get going, Anna. So, what do you think about this incident? Oh, just forget about it. That drunkard always gets himself into trouble. I suspect it was Regina who left him there. But why? I'm sure they just had one of their wild arguments. Do you mind if I look around? Sure. I'd say it's a mechanic's glove. Why does it bother you? It could have been lost a long time ago. There is no dirt or dust on it. It was left here recently. Good evening. Welcome to our home. Good evening, Signor Akotsi. Please follow me. Giuseppe is waiting in the dining room. Ciao! Good evening, Officer Cozzi. Coffee or tea? Coffee, please. Uh, me too. So, are you enjoying our festival, Miss Myers? Yes, absolutely. It's so much fun. In fact, I went to visit her. Our trout is exceptional, don't you think? Yes, it's delicious. Don't act like you don't hear me, Giuseppe. The baby was born the day before yesterday, Lord, forgive me. But she won't reveal the name of the father. Lord, my heart is broken, but you are near. My spirit is crushed, but you are my rescuer. Your word is my hope. Here is your coffee, Miss Myers. Thanks. 
What a lovely Austrian porcelain. Yes, my, my darling, Theodora and I were on holidays in Austria. Don't you darling me. Theodora, please stop this. We found Adriano, by the way. Oh, really? I bet he was drinking again. No, he went down into the crypt to hide from the heat. Into the crypt? <sighs> that drunkard never ceases to amaze me. But somebody pulled the rope up and Adriano was trapped. We think it was Regina. Another small family argument, I suppose. It can happen to the best of us, right, honey? You call that a small argument? I'm afraid to think what would have happened if it had been a big one. Well, I think we should get going. Yes, it's been an eventful day. Officer Cozzi, Signora Cozzi, thank you for your hospitality. Thank you for coming. Please come again, Miss Myers. That was so awkward. <laughs> Theodora is always like that. Don't mind her. She was talking about Chloe Como, wasn't she? Yes. Chloe had been working as a housekeeper. And Theodora suspects that Signor Cozzi might be the father of her child. Are you kidding me? That's what the rumors say. Well, that explains a lot. Signora Cozzi was so mad that she kicked Chloe out onto the street. She was left with barely any money, no place to live, and the baby was due. My gosh. What did she do? Fortunately, Marco let her stay in the room above the cafe. What a relief. What about you? Do you have a place to stay? Oh my. I completely forgot about that. Don't worry. I talked with Officer Cozzi. You can use the same apartment you used the last time. Ronaldo is in jail and his property has been confiscated, so you are free to use it. Herman has already delivered your luggage there. All right. Thank you, Luigi. Let me walk you there. Luigi, I'd like to visit Chloe tomorrow. But I told you, she doesn't want to see or talk to anybody. Maybe she will make an exception. I really doubt it. Well, I'll see you tomorrow, Anna. Good night. What an eventful day. But it's time to get some sleep.